developing tonight. Chicago police say they've arrested one of the suspects in a violent attack on the CTA that was caught on video. WGN's Jewel Hillary is at police headquarters with the latest. Jewel. Hi, Lourdes and Ray. 30 year old Solomon Washington, who we're told is no stranger to police in Glenwood, a south suburb, is behind bars and charged with several felony counts in connection to not one but two attacks within about 24 hours. Oh, oh my God! On Sunday, September 24th, around 2.45 a.m. on the red line at 95th Street, cell phone video captures two suspects rob this 44-year-old CTA passenger and slam a glass bottle onto his head. The following day, investigators say the same suspect struck again, this time attacking a 46-year-old man by punching him in the face. And then about 24 hours later, he robbed the second individual at the 95th Street Station as well. On Wednesday, September 28th, authorities arrested 30-year-old Solomon Washington as a suspect in both crimes. Washington is charged with four felony counts, including armed robbery and aggravated battery. And I truly want to thank the state's attorney's office for working with us on these two robbery cases. Um, they weren't, I'm not going to go into all the details, but it was not simple in order to secure charges on these cases. CPD Chief of Detectives Brendan Dinahan says catching suspects like Washington wouldn't be possible without help from CTA security. CTA security does a remarkable job working with our officers and detectives. They constantly comb through video that helps us put out seeking to identify bulletins and other videos, which then we release to the public. While Washington is off the streets, authorities are still looking for another suspect involved in Sunday's early morning attack. So if anybody can identify that second offender, then go to cpdtip.com or call CTA security or call or call the area one detective division. On Friday, Washington is expected to appear in bond court at 26th in California. For now, reporting live from CPD headquarters, I'm Jewel Hillary, WGN News.